Usually, you have to look down and around to see Colorado's wildflowers. Look up, though, to the roof of the CSU Spur Building in Denver, and you will see more up there. It's an experiment to find out which flowers will bring pollinators into the city. There really is nothing more graceful and artistic than seeing a large blossom that's just saturated with color in the middle of a place that you would least expect it. We are on the Colorado State University Spur campus, one of two green roofs on the three building campus. The big deal with the wildflowers is that in just two months time, we can go from seed to beautiful blooms and provide resources for our pollinators. My graduate student and collaborators at the Denver Botanic Gardens and I are looking to try to find sort of the minimum amount of seed we can put out to, to garner the most benefits for both the pollinators and all the other resources. Like we can sequester carbon, we can manage storm water, and we can help cool our environment by adding plants. So here's the wonderful thing. This is a little bit of heaven on a place that's normally ignored. I mean, if you look at downtown Denver, there's over 5,000 acres of eligible rooftops. Even if we just greened a few more of those rooftops, imagine how many resources we could have in our urban areas. As long as we just curate um, the way that we install these, uh, I think we can have beautiful, functional, and provide uh, resources for pollinators all at once.